What's up guys, in this short tutorial, I will show you how to fix the This PC can't run Windows 11 error you are getting when checking if your PC meets the system requirements to run the new Windows OS or when trying to install it. This should be quite an easy tutorial, everything you need will be listed in the description below. This error will show up due to various reasons. First of all, the Secure Boot feature in the BIOS setting might be disabled, leading to the error. To fix this, search for System Information in your taskbar search and press Enter. On the right side of the screen, look at BIOS Mode and Secure Boot State. If BIOS Mode shows UEFI and Secure Boot State shows off, then Secure Boot is disabled. To enable Safe Boot, you will need to restart your PC and enter your BIOS settings. Depending on which motherboard you are using, there are different ways to get there. In your Advanced BIOS options, make sure to locate the Secure Boot option and enable it. You should then restart your PC again and Safe Boot will be enabled. Next, your PC must support the Trusted Platform Module 2.0. Use the shortcut Windows Key and R to open up your Run dialog box. Here, type tpm.msc and hit Enter. A window titled TPM Management on Local Computer will open up. Here, you can preview if it's enabled or not. In my case, it's not enabled. In order to make sure that TPM is ready to use, you will have to restart your PC again and open up the Startup menu while restarting. This will give you the option to enable the TPM device in your security settings. You will then be able to download and install Windows 11 on your PC. I hope this helped you out. Leave a comment if you have any questions and see you in the next one.